I love hair extensions. I'm Tiffany Twist, and this is my hair extension studio. Welcome to West Coast Hair. I've been wearing my products for over a decade. I've used lots of tools and gained lots of experience and can help you get the best wear for your hair extensions because I have made every mistake. Hopefully, sharing with you will allow you to learn about both my styling successes and those things I avoid. I get a lot of unsolicited compliments for many of my styles, and you will too. So, you get this beautiful hair in, and of course, you wanna style it. Heat styling your extensions will give them their best look and allow you days of fantastic styled hair. Yes, even after sleeping in it. <laughs> We're installing high quality, 100% human hair. You can style it just like your own hair. You can use a hair dryer, flat iron, curling iron, hot rollers, Velcro rollers. There are just some precautions you'll take when doing so. You be sure you are keeping the attachments protected from too high heat. What is too high heat? A good rule of thumb is this. What your skin can handle, your attachment can handle as well. So you wouldn't set a flat iron on your skin. Same with your bonds. You'll want to iron under the attachment point. You wouldn't hold a hair dryer too close to your skin for a period of time. And it's the same with the attachments. If you hold a too high heat hair dryer at your attachments for too long and then pull with a brush, for example, you risk pulling out attachments. If you accidentally go over an attachment with a flat iron or a curling iron, then let that attachment cool and harden before brushing and styling further. The same rule of, with your high heat hair dryer. Allow the hair extension attachments to cool before you're pulling and brushing. When it comes to styling products, you'll wanna refrain from using gels and oils at the area of the attachments. They can break down the bonds. Heat protectant is okay to use, but only on dry hair. Hairspray is fine to use in and around your bonds um, and on your extension hair, but only once dry. Refrain from using styling products in your extensions while they're wet. Many contain ingredients that when dried into the hair can cause tangling. Don't bend or roll or otherwise manipulate your attachments while they're wet. You'll break down the bond by doing this. Because the soft bond merely holds the extension hair in place and does not attach to your hair, you'll lose extensions sooner over time if you do this. I do recommend my 3D oil for your heat protectant. This is also great for taming frizzies in your hair, especially during the dry winter. We know that ultimately heat styling is excellent to give you um, a great finished look for your extension wear and one that will give you great looking hair for many days. You want to be thoughtful in the tools you use and one thing I want to recommend is that you learn to use a curling wand over a curling iron. This is because many times with a curling iron you can twist up your strands without the knowledge of it. This happens when you curl the extension and then you pull the iron out of the hair without unwinding it first. This action is eliminated in a wand as you're wrapping the hair around the barrel and not twisting it around the barrel as you do when you clasp the hair in the iron. If you do use a curling iron with a clasp like this one, um, be sure you unwind the hair when you've finished uh, heating the hair. You'll want to be aware of the products you use and their ingredients. Typically, any extension hair issues such as tangling or feeling dry is the result of using excess products. Always remember, just having clean hair is best for your extensions, your attachments, your own hair, and the health of your skin and scalp. Coating the hair with many products so many times does not enhance the hair or your wear. If there's been an overuse of products that you think could be affecting your hair extension, uh, extension hair, um, a really great wash and a vinegar rinse or two can resolve this. If you have any further questions regarding styling heat or the tools you use, please ask your installer now. They are delighted to assist. Thank you for choosing West Coast Hair.